Hi it's Super Videos, back at you for another Q&A video. This video contains a lot of comic spoilers, so consider this your spoiler alert. So today's questions are all related to The Walking Dead TV show. So the first question comes from Brandon Curtis. There's a few questions he asks, so I'm just going to go through them one by one. The first part of the question is, do you think it's possible that Daryl takes Carl's storyline from the comic where Negan has a special bond with him? Uh, so to answer the question, no, I don't think that's going to happen because the Carl Negan relationship is very important for Carl's development as a character and also for the story in the next few seasons. So I don't think they're going to change that in the show. They're going to keep it the way it was in the comic book and Carl will have his relationship with Negan more or less the same way as it was in the comic book. Um, the next part of the question is, do you think that Negan will take Daryl as a hostage to his sanctuary? I think if Daryl survives the Lucille death, which I strongly believe he will, um, there is a chance that Negan will take Daryl with him to the sanctuary as a way to keep control of Rick. Uh, because to Negan, this group is very strong, is very capable, so they need to be controlled somehow. And I, I could very well see him take Daryl in order to control the group and make sure that they're not doing anything outside his orders. So I think it's definitely possible for Negan to take Daryl, yes. If so, do you think Daryl will try to escape Negan's sanctuary? Uh, it's definitely within character for him to try to escape because he's not gonna be imprisoned he's not gonna follow someone like that so definitely he would try to escape i believe he will if he's taken he will be trying to escape do you think he will be successful or get caught which could result in daryl getting his face burned with a hot iron by negan or gets caught but nothing happens to him um i think uh, he won't be successful if that happens because as we see, the Saviors have so many people and they're so organized, so I don't think it's easy to escape the Sanctuary. I think he'll be caught, but I don't think that he'll get his face ironed because it's like giving someone's arc to some other character, which I don't really like in this case. So, no. The next question comes from Swag Crafting HD. What do you think about Daryl being the one who takes out a load of Saviors instead of Carl? I don't agree with that. I think that's necessary for Carl, for his character, for his development, for his growth. So I think we definitely need to see that. And I don't like the idea of changing Carl to Daryl for that scene. I just don't like it. So yeah, the next question comes from Omar Khan and they ask, what do you think Carl's future looks like in the show? How long will he be alive? I think, like I said, he's very important in a comic book even right now so I don't see them killing him off anytime soon in the TV show and I think his future is gonna look more or less the same as it did in the comic book and it's gonna follow the same arc because um, he is too much of a big character for them to be changing you know his arc significantly so I think it's gonna be the same and the other thing I want to say is that in the comic book, the story is just about Rick Grimes as it is about Carl Grimes. And it's the same way in the show, I think. In the next couple of seasons, I think the story is going to be just as much about Rick Grimes as it is about Carl Grimes. So I think there'll definitely be a shift from Rick being the center to Carl being the center of the story. So I, I think he's going to live for a long, long time, at least in the TV show. In the comic book, it's still up in the air what's going to happen, but in the in the show, I think he'll he's going to live for a long, long time. Leave your questions in the comment section below. Just make sure that you put Q&A before your comment so I can find it. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll be back for the next Q&A video.